Edwards. Can you tell me your full name, please? My name is Nikhil Rajit. And can you tell me where you're from? I'm from Kotem, a small town in Kerala, situated near to the backwaters. All right. Can I see identification, please? Sure. Thank you. Now, in this first part, I'd like to ask you a few questions about yourself. Let's talk about your weekends. What do you usually do at the weekends? In weekends, I like in the weekends I'm getting my most of the leisure times. I used to spend my time with my friends, go out with my family for a, a, a food at uh, night, and yeah, uh, with my hobbies. Can you tell me why are weekends important for any individual? Weekends are very important for individual because the the time the individuals are getting free. Like to express themselves to the whatever they are wish to, uh, to get free means uh, to do what they wish to. Like, can you tell me what do you plan for the next weekend? For next weekend, I plan to go out with my friends to some cool places like uh, Muna. This uh, situation hill station. It's very cold out there. All right, let's move on and talk about clothes. Where do you buy most of your clothes from? I buy my clothes from uh, Reliance Trends near to the Cotton Town. They have a variety of trend, trend of dresses. How often do you buy new clothes for yourself? Uh, uh, once, uh, thrice in a uh, six months. All right. How do you decide which clothes to buy? Clothes, uh, which feels. Uh, Comfortable for my eyes. For my eyes. Let's move on to the next part of this discussion. In this part of the test, I'll give you a topic, and I'd like you to speak about it for one to two minutes. Before that, you have one minute to think about what you're going to say. You can make some notes if you wish. I hope you understand. Yeah. And you have your paper and pencil to take your notes. And your topic for today is: Describe an interesting discussion you had about how you spend your money. Alright, now remember you have one to two minutes for this, so don't worry if I stop you, I'll tell you when your time is up. And can you start speaking now please? Okay. I spend more of my money on my needs actually because uh, I'm not so rich a person but I want to satisfy all my needs and from my needs I want to be feel that okay, I am satisfied with this. So uh, I don't spend too much on with, uh, things which are useless for me. Actually speaking, uh, last week I bought a car and it cost up to 8 lakhs. So many of the cars came into my mind and why I particularly choose that car is that it's a value for money because I thought that this car could satisfy all my needs which I want, I'm not going to satisfy any of the people which are seen like uh, others who, I don't, uh, I don't care about what others value. So I don't spend money for satisfaction of others. So uh, I, when I spend money on something, I think about it twice, thrice. And uh, I talk about my family before I spend something on huge money on something. I spend wisely, I think so, because uh, I know the value of money. Did you 
ever have a discussion about how you spend your money with anyone on actually what you can do for the future by keeping money away? Obviously, I speak with my parents most because they know how to spend money and uh, frankly speaking, they give the money for me. Actually, I have not had ever person. So. Alright, thank you very much. That brings us to the end of our cue card discussion. Can I have the cue card paper and pencil back please? Thank you. Now, we were talking about a discussion you had about how you spend your money. I'd like to ask you a few more questions related to the same topic. Yes. Let's talk about money and young people. Why do some parents give their children money to spend each week? Because uh, nowadays, children are busy with their own activities. They have uh, classes all the weeks. They have friends. So in the weekends, they will be doing some activities which they like to. Obviously, maybe because... Do your parents give you money? Yeah. Yes, my parents... So what do you do with that money? I do uh, a part of this money I will always keep for my savings. And with the rest, I do spend it with my friends. Do you agree that schools should teach children how to manage money? Yes, it's a must because nowadays the children are not getting into the value of the money. So I think it's a mandatory thing that the schools should teach the students to. Do you think it's a good idea for students to earn money while they are studying? Yes, because students should know how to uh, keep the money with them and how to spend because in the future they are going to. So it is very good to develop like where you are studying and they can cope with their own uh, earnings. Alright, thank you very much. That brings us to the end of our speaking test. Thank you.